Hi crafters, it's Hannah here from Handcrafted Creations. Welcome to this week's colour challenge video. This is the card that I'm going to be showing you how to make today. We're going to be using the Eastern Beauty stamp set along with the coordinating dies. So um, if you're new to my channel then please subscribe so you don't miss any tutorials and we will get started. So we're going to start by choosing our numbers. This week's numbers were chosen by Nona, one of my long-term subscribers. And her numbers were 40, 45 and 50. So that gives us number 40, which is Flirty Flamingo. 45 is Powder Pink. Nice. And number 50 is... Highland Heather, nice. So we've got uh, Flirty Flamingo, Powder Pink and Highland Heather. I'll go and grab those colours and then we can make a start on this card. Okay, okay. so we've got Powder Pink, Flirty Flamingo and Highland Heather cardstock. And this is going to be our card base. So the stamp set that we're using this week is the Eastern Beauty stamp set and the coordinating dies. So I've got all of mine in here all together. So that's the Eastern Medallions dies and the Eastern Beauty stamp set. So what we're going to do is some die cutting with... Um, so I'm going to have a layer of Flirty Flamingo and then Whisper White on top. Now the reason I've got two is because, it, is because we're going to do some die cutting and then ink through the die cutting and then you'll see some pretty colours. So what I'm going to do is, um, how should I do this? So I'm going to use... Um, I think this one, you know what, let me just close that window, bear with. There we go, that's better. <laughs> I'm going to do the circle one there and then I think just the smaller one there and then just this one down there so it's going to go from small to large so basically it's going to be like that so let me grab my uh, whoops i will do the die cutting with you just so you can see um how that works so let's just get this going so i'll do the these ones first, like so. It would help if it was the right way around, wouldn't it? Oh dear. So if it goes off the edge, obviously that's fine. Well, this one's going to. And we'll start with that first. this big one and then these will cut but won't cut out the whole circle so you're left with a little bit of a frame kind of thing so then what we need to do is firstly get all your bits out your die so I've just got the dye brush and the sponge that goes with it. So you can just brush all your bits out. You need to make sure all of the bits are out. Otherwise when you come to do the next cut, it won't cut quite so smoothly. And the dye brush is the quickest way of doing that. Even though I do enjoy sitting with a pokey tool <laughs> and poking them all out. So for the next um, 
bit. I'm actually going to use the magnetic plate. So bring that in. And then we need to add this one to the middle of there. So I'm just lining up. Um, just pick any of the shapes to start lining up with the die cut that's already done. And this one's going to go in the middle there. Okay. And using the um, magnetic plate, it just holds the dies in place so that they'll stay lined up nicely. out gently there we go and then this one so we need this one again so I'm just gonna quickly brush that off whoops just using my dye brush again making sure those bits are out and then we can bring it back in just for this last middle one here. Like so. And then you've got your three designs there. So let me just clean up my bits and <laughs> we'll cap. Okay, so that's what we have got. So you can see you've got your absolutely love this die set, it's awesome. Okay, so this piece is gonna be slid underneath it and then we're gonna do some inking on the on this piece underneath. So I've got powder pink and flirty flamingo. So what I think I'm going to do is start with the darker colour in the middle which will be the flirty flamingo and then go to the lighter colour where have I just put just one there that needs popping out so yeah flirty flamingo and then slowly go into powder pink so I'm going to hold it that away just so I can know roughly where to start I'm going to start here with Flirty Flamingo. Come on, shaking. Okay. That's better. So, we can have a look. I want it a little bit bigger. And then go into the powder pink on the edge. And blend the two together. And then just keep blending till you're happy with it. Okay, thanks, Mum. Yep, I'm happy with that. There we go. So then over to this one because the uh, uh, what's it called? Powder pink has already started to come over to here. I'm just going to do this one all in the powder pink. So it's about there. Let's see. A little bit more this side. And it doesn't have to be perfectly blended because it's kind of covered up anyway. So... Uh, 
There we go, and then down here I'm going to do Flirty Flamingo. Just like that. That looks good. And then what I'm going to do is ink the edges because you are going to see ever so slightly this edge. So I think it'll look nice if it's inked. you'll get a hint of the darker colour and you can always trim it down if you need to which I might have to somehow I've managed to get my layers wrong <laughs> that's okay yep yeah, I'm happy with that um, before we stick it together I'm just going to do the stamping on here and I want one of the curvy sentiments. Um, a note for you. Yep. I think down there will look nice. And we'll go with Flirty Flamingo. There we go. Cute. So then we can stick this together. I'm going to use Tombow just so I can get um, it into place easier. So I go around and then make sure you get all these little edges that are sort of like half cut just to make sure they're stuck down nicely. You can always put a dot in the middle of these bits as well like that there on make sure this edge is flush because that's the cut edge And then you can trim off as needs be. See these bits, these edges here, you don't want those lifting up. So make sure you've got glue right across those edges and then you'll be fine. Okay, just take my big scissors and trim. I don't know how I've managed to get my layers off, but oh well. I think I'm going to leave that one actually, that just kind of gives it a nice little edge. Cool. And, oh no, I still need that. I want the Flirty Flamingo. And I'm going to stamp on the inside piece with which one? The little flower. So, layering this up, let's make sure that does fit, yes it does, <laughs> um, so flat onto my layer of Flirty Flamingo, 
then it popped up onto the card base. Oh, nearly stuck it upside down then. Gorgeous. And I'll just pop this on the inside. And there we go. What do you think? I love how that's turned out. I'm really pleased with that, how the sort of ombre look is going on. Yep, so that is this week's colour challenge for the class that I've done with the Eastern Beauty stamp set. Just click on the screen and it will be right there and then there's another video over there for you to watch. And then around here somewhere will be the subscribe button. So if you haven't subscribed already then please do. Thanks for watching and I'll see you next time.